we are on to our fourth box. I don't get this style often, but I was able to get two of them. And they are not the plastic rolls there, the paper rolls just sideways. But uh, I thought I saw one of them had a wheat ender. I'm gonna check the top row. Not sure, it might've been the other box. So let's go ahead and start the first row. First row, we got a wheat. It's a 1949 Denver. Pretty cool. And we got 2009. That is a young Lincoln. So on to the next. Three rolls later, we got three more wheats. A 1945 Denver, a 56 Denver, and a 44 Plain. So pretty cool. That's four wheats. And we got this really nice 1960 Denver. Really nice. That'll go in two by two. So on to the next. Next roll, another wheat. 1950 Plain. That makes five wheats. So on to the next. Couple of rolls later, we have another wheat. This one's got a little bit of war worn to it, so let's see what it is. 1929 Denver. Wow, pretty cool. That makes, I think that's six already. We got a Canadian, 1965, and another really nice 1960, also a Denver. So, on to the next roll. Three rolls later, we got two more wheats, a 1945 plane and a 1934 plane. That makes eight. Yeah. The next. Couple rolls later, another wheat, 1956 Denver. That's nine. And on to the next. Couple rolls later, another wheat, and it's a 1937. Wow, pretty cool. I think that is four. That's ten. Pretty cool. On to the next. Couple rolls later, and in this roll, we had three wheats, and they all showed up back up. So let's see what they are. 1940 plane. 1944 Denver and 1951 Denver. Pretty cool, that's 13. And on to the next. A couple rolls later, I poured this roll out and as I was pushing the roll out, I realized that this dime was on the end of the roll. So there's a dime in the roll and it was on the end. So a dime ender in a penny box, 1996P. That's, that's pretty funny. And I also saw a wheat right here, 1940. So that's 14 wheats. Let's take a quick look at the rest of these. There's some nice shiny ones. But, uh, other than that, I've seen any older ones. This is 1972 right here. It's very shiny. 72 Denver. So, that's pretty cool. It's funny. First dime of the year in a penny box. Had a couple dimes last year and the year before. It's always funny. But nothing else, so on to the next row. A couple rolls later, we have another wheat, 1945 plane. So that is 15 wheats. And on to the next. Just poured out another roll and we have another dime. This is strange. This one actually, I see why it, uh, got into a penny roll. It's been flattened out to about the size of a penny. But that's funny, two dimes. I think I had a box before where I had two dimes in it, in a penny box. But uh, anything in here? We got a wheat, 1944 plane. That is 16 wheats. And I don't see anything else right off the bat, so I'll look through those. And on to the next. A couple rolls later, we have two more wheats. Let's see what they are. 1948 Denver and 1948 Denver. Wow, look at that. Two of the same year in mint marks. So that is 18 weeks. And on to the next roll. Three rolls later, we have three more weeks. Let's see what they are. 1955 Denver, 1950 Denver, and 1951 Denver. So pretty cool. That is 21 weeks. And on to the next. Four rolls later, we have two more wheats, a 1951 Denver, and a 1941 plane. So that's 23, and on to the next. We got another wheat with a couple rolls left in the box, 1953 Denver. So that's 24, and on to the next. So the box is over, and let's go over what we got. We got a 1967 Canadian, 1980, 1978, and 1965. For the 2009s, we had Young Lincoln, Birth and Childhood, Professional Life, Young Lincoln, Young Lincoln, Young Lincoln, Young Lincoln, Young Lincoln, and Young Lincoln. A lot of those. We had two dimes. Uh, I can't tell what this one is, but it's 2010 era. 
1996 P. We had two really nice uncirculated 1960s, a 60 Denver and a 60 Denver, pretty cool. And for the wheats, we had 24, 53 Denver, 51 Denver, 51 Denver, 44 Denver, 55 Denver, 45, 48 Denver, 56 Denver, 37, 44, 50 Denver, that's a 45 Denver, 44, 40, 41, 40, 34, 51 Denver, 40, Five, fifty, and a 29 Denver, 56 Denver, 48 Denver, and a 49 Denver. So, pretty good box, a lot of weeds, a lot more than the other boxes. So, thanks for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe.